Uncanny X-Men 188. The X-Men are being attacked by some shadow beings. Naze is possessed and is casting some really ominous spells. Something else takes control of him and he passes out. Nightcrawler teleports Amanda Sefton away from her day job. He takes her to Forge's penthouse and she casts a spell to free the X-Men. Ileana teleports in and starts disrupting some shadow magic. Amanda and Ileana both try to stop the shadow beings, but nothing works. Amanda thinks it's black magic and Nightcrawler and Forge find a diorite on the rooftop casting spells, so Forge kills it. The chaos ends and Storm reminds Forge that she still has a bone to pick with him. In the Bermuda Triangle, Lee Forrester saves a man from a shark attack and it ends up being Magneto. At the mansion, Rachel eavesdrops on an X-Men meeting. Nightcrawler wants to call it quits because he thinks humans will always hate mutants. He mentions his friends who have died and Rachel is shocked to hear Jean Grey's name. She freaks out and starts side blasting everyone until Xavier calms her down. She says Jean can't be dead because she's her mom and then she tells everyone about how different and terrible her timeline is from this one. She convinces the X-Men to stay together. Elsewhere, a man cuts open a fish and finds a strange blue geminate that starts promising him the world.